So here we're looking at our 2015 65 plate Volkswagen Golf R Estate. So it's finished in Tornado Red and it's been de-chromed. So it has black trim all round with glass back mirrors. It's sitting on 18 inch Oz alloy wheels in excellent condition. And it also has a APR stage one Rima. So you'd be expecting around 370 horsepower and 370 foot-pounds of torque. So very safe remap with APR and a very nice delivery as well. Really smooth through the rev range. So you've also got some rear spats here. Just leading up to the rear diffuser. And obviously the black badges as well. So a total of nine services in total for this and just over 43,000 miles. So exceptionally well looked after. And this will be the third time we've sold this vehicle. So we always try and buy back our vehicles if possible, as long as they've been maintained to a high standard. And it will have Michelin matching tires all around. The front two are being replaced, they're just on order. Let's take a look at the D-chrome at the front as well. Really sets the car off. So we'll just take a look inside now. So just taking a look at the passenger side now, you'll see no marks on the door card. In excellent condition on the Clough and Alcantara seats. And it's also got a little bit of paint protection film on the sill there. It's a really nice touch. Obviously the original book pack. Just moving into the rear now. Again, exceptional condition. Has to be one of the cleanest examples available at the moment, I believe. So just taking a look in the boot now. That all retracts fine. You've got a double load boot floor there as well. That's gonna be a little bit tricky, but you do have the spare wheel in there as well. Let's fold that back in. Let right, me just close this down. You will see it's got a little Maxton spoiler lip on there as well. It's a very nice touch. And finally, moving into the driver's side, all your control switch and the electric folding mirrors there. Limited wear on these seats, still looking really fresh. We'll just start it up now. And rear driver side now. Okay, so just in the driver's seat now, we'll just get it started. So as you can see, it's got the Mark 7.5 uh, nav screen there, which does make it look a lot more modern inside. Just let that load up for a moment. You've also got the adaptive cruise on here, switch that off and the mileage will just come up there and the carbon fiber paddles there as well. So there's the sat nav and we've got multiple driving modes. Let's get these up. There's the app connect as well, so you can just plug in your phone and get Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, so all your apps will come up on the screen, including Waze and Spotify, apps like that. There we go, so driving modes. Uh, so going into individual, obviously you can change them however you please, or you can go into the preset modes, go into race, you'll see the revs rise slightly there. Steering gets slightly heavier, and the throttle response is slight, short, excuse me, slightly sharper in race. Obviously you've got normal, the revs just drop down there, and then eco as well. 
And then stand on the right hand side, you've got your auto headlights and then auto wipers there as well. And obviously the multi-functional steering wheel and auto dimming rear view mirror. So I think that's everything for inside. So I'll just finish off outside now. So guys, that's all for the video. So any other queries or questions, please do get in touch with the sales team and our contact information should be on the screen now. Thank you.